What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to some more standard content here on uh, YouTube.com slash Frank Lepore or Twitch.tv slash Frank Lepore. And uh, we are playing some Mardu Aristocrats. Uh, you can find the link, you can find the deck list in the description, or you, if you're watching on stream, you can find it in the Stream Decker extension on the desktop arena. <coughs> <clears throat> Skew! Will you please tell us your version of the aristocrats joke? No, that would take way too long. Oh, oh, I like this hand except for the fact that I don't like it, but I do because we can literally cast everything <clears throat> except for the hero. So I'll keep it. Turn one gutter bones, that's alright. Mar, do your version of the joke. That's good. All right. Gutter bones. Included in your cover letter. <clears throat> Solid strategy. Will you please sing us your version of scales and arpeggios from the aristocrats? I don't think I'm going to do that either. But I really appreciate you guys... Uh, Asking for my renditions of things. Well, this guy's hard to deal with. Oh, you said Aristocats. Dang it. Wow, I called it the Aristocrats. You are right. It was... Okay. Nice. Leveling is easy, boys. So we're basically, <clears throat> basically unbeatable. This was probably the best standard deck I've ever played. Wow, this deck is good. <laughs> you are not wrong. Oh, a true fire captain, huh? Blah, blah, blah. Thank you so much for the resub. We really appreciate it. You're a Lizrog, Harry. You're a Lizrog, Harry. Did that pop up on the screen, and did you guys hear it? I did not. So let me know. Ooh, one land, huh? A bold strategy, Cotton. Did not pop. All right, let me see if I can refresh it. See if that helps. On screen, but no sound. Interesting. I'm all again. I'm all again. Do you prefer MTG or the old-fashioned Magic Online? Doesn't matter. I have no preference. Whichever one lets me play the formats I want. If I if I had to play if they had modern on here, I'd play modern on here. If they have it on Magic Online, I'll play it on Magic Online. <clears throat> oh, we're good at this game. Finish the stream now. You have the clickbait title for the video. Standard Martyr Scouts, 100% win rate. <laughs> Never dropped a game. Wow, he really didn't drop a game. Well, that was good. Unexpected and good. Ooh. <sighs> well, Priest is okay. <clears throat> I wish I had a way to kill this. I don't. So what are they? They untap with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana if they play land, so they can just go Hydroid Crassus for six. Okay, that's not, that's not impressive, I guess. All right. Uh, decline. Oh, I don't have three mana. We could play Gutter Bones and Footlight Fiend. Sack both, kill this. They draw a card. We get two mana. 
and we draw a card. And they have to sack another creature? Alright, I'm game. Are you sure? Yes. Target any number of players? This player. Oh, they're just gonna sack this guy though, aren't they? Isn't that how that works, right? Uh, sacrifice two of the creatures. No, because it would resolve. Like this, this could go on the stack on top of it, okay. Target any number of players. Any number, yeah, right, so submit. This guy and this guy, submit. This is gonna go on the stack first. Kill this. Now they have to sack one of these two. <clears throat> Resolve. A land here would be great. I would love to drop a Judith. Seems good. Took my priest, huh? It's fascinating. How do we deal 10 extra points with this deck? That is the question. <clears throat> Seems unlikely now. I guess we just play priests forever. We did get two black mana, but what could we do with it? Oh, I guess we could have gotten gutter bones back. I forgot because it sits here. Like, it's not very obvious when you have it. Yeah, you guys are right. We could have played another priest or gotten gutter bones back. That is a good point. This card does a lot of things. It's really hard to keep track of all the things that are happening right now. <clears throat> I love that nature's little treasure is still called Jiposhi. That's pretty good. Sack a creature? Sure. Pretty good. Yeah, alright. So if we can't hit a third land... I think we have yet to hit a third land in any of these games yet. How many lands are in this deck? Like, 22? Let's find out. 24 lands. Alright, well, there's really no reason that we aren't hitting lands here. <clears throat> and grass seems great. Uh, let's take out... Take out one Torchlight Fiend, one Priest. Bring in the two and grass. I also do like Lava Coil. What do you think the most overrated card in RNA Limited is? Um, Ill-gotten inheritance. I, I think it's <laughs> it's a card that people keep talking about, and I think it's fine, but I really don't think it's as good as people are making it out to be. <clears throat> I think it cements your win when you're ahead, and when you're behind, it's just not great. And I don't think that's the I don't think that's the hallmark of a great card. I think that's a, that's the hallmark of a win more card. Which is, it's an average card, it's a fine card, but like, I don't think it's, I don't think it's all that. I had another land of the dino that cut the find a land raptor to two and added, isn't, aren't those all the things I did? Isn't that literally just what I did yesterday? <clears throat> So basically what you're saying is, I nailed it. 
Okay, now which RNA card and RNA draft pair is best with a nice Merlot? Um, any of the vampires, I would imagine. Okay, well, way to toot your own <laughs> Oh, man. Poked into Ben's stream while you're on break. He was saying the same. Basically, in his opinion, it's really good in aggro. Playable filler in mid-range. Bad in control unless it's control mirror, which is okay. Yeah, it's right. I, I agree with all that. Wow, that was cool. But it was not cool. Can't be blocked by white creatures, sure. Does your water smell like fish butts? <laughs> well, that's a thing. That is a thing. <clears throat> I can't actually see a reason not to attack here. This is a lot of damage. Even if they block two biggest guys, they take 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 7, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, they go to 3. Oh, they actually go to 2 because of the... Yikes. <clears throat> that is la yikes for me, dog. You know what? It does a little. It does smell like fish butts a little bit. Oh my god. How many plague mares you got in here, my dude? It doesn't matter when you draw the 2 2 haste creature in there, too. It doesn't matter how many plague mares you have at that point. I just drink Topo Chico and Gatorade and Yoritos, Pat's belly. Wow. <laughs> oh, crying out loud. I, I was actually going to be like, wait, I hope there's four heroic enforcements in this deck. That card's amazing. And there are. So that's good. We did good. I think this might just be better than Mortify here in the main deck because they don't have really enchantments that we care about. And Mortify and Lava Coil kills basically all the things they're playing. Short of like Hydroid Crassus, but we can actually steal that and kill them with it. Do they have that in Florida? I don't know if I've had to, but I, they might. I don't know if I, I, I just may have never had it. Seems fine. We can go gutter bones into hero Priest saint one, and we only take four thousand damage. Oh, that's nice. Okay, so we can play. You. Oh, we messed up. I was trying to minimize the damage because dragon skull summon's gonna come and play untapped, and I wanted a white. I need a white source for turn two. So, eh, there was no way to play gutter bones there without like taking taking some damage. Everybody. Wouldn't it just be Mike Tears? Can we just call him Mike Tears? Or Brooklyn Mike? Okay, well, Lava Coil. Sometimes... God, 
he never didn't have it. Did you see him have it? He drew his card and then he had it. It was amazing. What a time to be alive. Okay, you got it. Do you have another land? Wow, you do have a land. But you don't have a second blue? Oh, biscuits. Buttery, buttery biscuits. How much damage is this? One, they're gonna block here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, because this guy dies. <clears throat> we could have held back here our pre saint one, but I imagine they're going to steal it if we do hold it back. Okay. Fascinating. If they steal Hero, do they not take Judith? That's interesting. So now they just go hostage taker and play the Hero? Is that what they're doing? Wow. Is Judith not scarier here? I feel like Judith is the scarier card, but... Three lands again is right. Hey! That's pretty good. Definitely keep little Judy back. I didn't do the math here. I assume they could block three, three. They take one, two, three, four, five, six. It might have been, might have been dead if we actually attacked with Judith. But I think we're still in pretty okay shape. Seven. Guess we just get back gutter bones. Or we can play priest here. Eh, I'd rather just have a guy on the board. <clears throat> we're not gonna be able to play this next turn, so presuming we can play we can deal damage next turn, I think we're fine. <laughs> oh my god. You need to get right out of here, my dude. Thirteen, huh? Click proceed. Yes. Sacrifice Torchy Boy. Oh, I'll choose you. Sacrifice Torchy Boy. Just submit. You and Reapy. <clears throat> Look at all my triggers. Target of current. Your face. Your face. Your face. And we get two extra mana, so we can actually get Gutter Bones and play Gutter Bones. I have that. <clears throat> yeah, Priest of the Forgotten Gods. Not terrible. Double Judith next turn probably uh, seals the deal. We can play Gutter Bones for one, sack these two. No, that's not. None of these are gonna kill. None of these are gonna save. Look at all those Judies. They are legendary, though. So let's not play any other additional ones. I would. I would imagine that's probably a bad idea. Uh, we can actually sacrifice these two. Thank you. Seems okay. If we attack with these three, right? They go block two. No, they don't die. To other creatures. Uh, you. you. We could have killed the Minute Reaper so that this dies, uh, and then we kill both of them, but they're actually pretty close to dead here, so. And by that, I mean they're basically dead here. Uh, 
Uh, block. Got him. Sleaterman, thanks so much for the resub. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. Did you guys hear that? Did it pop? I think it popped, right? What do we got here? A crater maker. Not a terrible card. Let's see. Is there anything you want to change about the deck? I feel like Mortify might be better off as Lava Coil, just because of the threats in Standard right now, but maybe not. I think I'm also erring on the side of, like, we haven't drawn that many lands. I think we can keep it going. It done popped. Nice. Boom, 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 boom. I, uh, yes, you, you would still get the Judith Damage Trigger. You might actually get two of them. I'll keep this. We can still go turn one, turn two this guy into Footlight Fiend or Mortify or something. I have Frank on mute, so I couldn't hear it. Yet you knew that I asked you if it popped. That's interesting. Hmm. It's an interesting, uh, interesting situation, my dude. Judy, Judy, Judy. It's a little, uh... It's a little... Curb Your Enthusiasm meme there. That's real mature. Can I draw a land? Dragon Skull Summit. A Dragon Skull Summit. That's not what I asked for. Okay, next turn, let's do another. Let's do next turn then, and then we can play both these guys and draw, make two, make two oney ones, oney one ones, oney McWonersons. I'm gonna play a crackling Drake, and my graveyard has 15 spells in it, so it's gonna be a 15-4, and then I'm gonna give it haste, and I'm gonna double strike it, and you're gonna die. <laughs> I can only play this guy, huh? Okay. Alright, well. I feel like no attacks is probably where we want to be. Heroic reinforcements next turn is pretty good. We got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 damage. That's a lot. There's 24 lands in this crispy hunk. Which I don't know why we're missing land drops. It does not feel correct. Solid JJ Yosarian impression. Yeah, I've been practicing it. Uh, I, me and JJ Yosarian have actually been talking uh, off stream about, uh, you know, about the oppression and stuff like that. But, you know, I kind of just want to kill this. But I think they have the protection, don't they? Don't they have like the plus one, plus oh, plus three or whatever? Do they have spell pierce? Is this a spell pierce deck? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Yosarian from Catch-22 is definitely what I thought of. Does this, what does this deck run? Do they have Dive Down or Spell Pierce? They have both of those, right? Oh, did they go attack us and then, then chart a course and opt? <laughs> that's, that's the impression that I get. They have both of them. Okay. Okay. Been close to those who have. No! I can also deal with it. Although you dealt four, so. Alright, well. If they can deal nine more damage, maybe Crackling Drake maximize. Ma Crackling Drake into maximize velocity kills us. So that's, exa that's exactly what they'll have. 
That is exactly what they'll have. Do, 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 do. No, they didn't have it. I am flamboozled by that. Okay, another, another charty boy. I don't think I want to sack anything here. Well, I was hoping for a land. This is not when it's the game, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. We're literally like one shy. We're one shy, shy. Hush, hush, I do mine. Oh, I was really hoping they do something so we could kill them. Yep, I don't think we're just out. I just don't think I have a way to deal with this guy. I mean, I'm sure they have it, so it's fine. Oh, dark down. I'm currently playing a game arena where my opponent is trying to million by chaining Tefries, but I'm just discarding my Nexus of Hate every turn. So the game is a draw, but neither of us is blinking. Should I concede? No. Judy, Judy, Judy. Play first. I will keep. You should both concede because you both deserve to lose. I can get there. I can get behind it. Look, there he is. There's that little cutie. Cutie Maduty. Tragedy, I felt God, Chris. I can't believe you got this song stuck in my head, dude. You getting this song stuck in my head is the impression that I get. That's the impression that I get. <sighs> I'm not sorry at all. I know, buddy. I know it. You are history's greatest monster. You beautiful, bald gentleman. You just got rid of my gutter bones? <laughs> Dummy. Joke's on you. I don't even need them bones. History's greatest lobster. He is history's greatest lobster. Can't believe everyone doesn't have a way to draw with Nexus and Teferi in the same and only format. I don't know why they're both in the same format.
Never had to knock on wood, but I know someone who has. And I'm sure it isn't good, because that's the impression that I get. Get your little stupid dirt burger out of here. Oh, that's sad. There's no perks to having a card in your hand in this in this deck, right? There's no like discard two cards, draw four, right? Like Uh decline. Oh, it's little Judy. You gonna counter my Judy? think so. Are you going to shock her? Oh, shocking. Oh, Judy, where did you go? Wow, this is just real. This is real mature. Well, on the bright side, guys, they're dead in seven turns because if this guy dies, they, they just... Multiples of her are good, but not in play. <laughs> so, you know. Hey, cool. More than two lands. Hey, cool. More than two lands. What's our bane fire? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They'd be dead. That is the gutter bones that I get. Do, 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 do. Have you ever had gutter bones so bad? It's just gonna bust your bones. Wow. This is this is an amount of rudeness that's pretty much unparalleled. What if they have two spell pierce? I'm gonna play around two spell pierce. They didn't have that. What they had is a funeral. I hacked into arena and stacked all your lands. That's okay. The password is swordfish. Wow, that doesn't surprise me at all. Um, I don't love Squee just because I don't think it does much. Right? Like, I think the idea of it is cool. It has a synergy, right? Like, you can get it back. You can sack it. There's no sack outlets, right? You can sack it to priest. But like the fact that it costs three mana every single time is a little rough. I can see playing like one squee. I'm a I'm a no sir this one. Oh, another another solid one. Yes. That's the gutter bones that I get. Oh, no, no, no red sources, huh? Okay. 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 Well, excuse me. You don't know my life. Memes run through your veins instead of blood. <laughs> oh, Squeeze survives Lava Coil. What is this link? Why are you like this? Have you ever had the odds to look <laughs> I really don't remember the actual lyrics. Did they just board in a bunch of removal so they have infinite removal but nothing to actually do? Because I don't understand what's going on here. Footlight Fiend, ladies and gentlemen. 
Ain't nobody got time for that. God, I have one black source, so I can't even get this guy back this turn. Why would he use my black source for that? Oh my god, that Goldfinger song literally came on at the restaurant I went to have dinner night last night. We're like, who is this, Goldfinger? Oh my god. That's some Tony Hawk memories right there, my dude. I can't believe he used my one black source for this. Why would you do that? Yeah, it's definitely a Tony Hawk Pro Skater song. Doing everything I can, and I'm a Superman. Shut up and take my money. Hey, Rick, glad you like our song, The Impression That I Get. Make sure you check out our new album while we're at it on Spotify or Apple Music. <laughs> Holy Jesus. Oh, if it isn't Judith. So they can block one. So they take, what, three, four, five, six, seven? Oh, that is, that is unfortunate. So they go block here, they take four, five, six, seven, eight. And then they go to oh god, this is rough. They literally have to block Midnight Reaper. No, they don't. They can block gutter bones. Dem bones, dem bones. God, we're so close here, it's so sad. Here I am. We get to draw a card. I don't know what it could be. Actually, I'm just going to kill this guy. That should keep us alive. That's actually so much better. Oh, they're going to have dive down, though, and then we're going to be dead on board. Oh, no, I feel bad. Choices. <sighs> so bad. Yep. They're at two. We have no way to sacrifice our guys. Oh, we could have shot the, f the Footlight Fiend. Oh, wow. If we shot Footlight Fiend, we would have had two points. Wow. We just didn't see the line. That sucks. We saw it literally too late. Oh, my God. Oh, man. I like that I saw it. I appreciate the fact that I saw it. Oh, wow. Yeah, if we shot our own Footlight Fiend, the Footlight Fiend would trigger deal them one. The Judith would trigger deal them one. I think Dive Down is a fair card. I don't know if it's a fun card, but it's a fair card. It's just a, it's a one-mana counter spell, basically. That only counters removal spells on your creatures. Yeah, I, I, I don't actually mind. We didn't lose anything. Nothing was lost. And uh, we learned something. It was a learning moment. Shoot the Footlight Fiend. <laughs> Dickie Barrett. Glad you like our song. <laughs> Damn, boy. Oh, my God, dude. Jesus. That's the impression that I get. <laughs> Jesus. Being able to change the message for donations is probably the best feature of Twitch. Or Streamlabs, I guess. Thank you. Disc Golfer, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Eight months. Really appreciate it. So here I am. 
Doing everything. I hate you guys so much. It's a very strong feeling, the hatred. It's real bad. Oh, a guild gate. We're playing against gate haze. Which means they're just gonna like, destroy all our creatures next time. That's sad. Oh wow, they did not destroy our creatures. Are they dead? Can we kill them? How much does heroic reinforcements deal? Like a thousand? You gotta rise up, rise up. Wow. Magic is a game, ladies and gentlemen. Man, why don't I play more aggressive decks? Whew. Let's uh, let's bring in the duresses here. Take out theater. We're bringing two duress. I want all four duress. I'll take out one. Shut one footlight fiend. One priest. John Feldman. Hey, Frank. Glad you like our song. <laughs> New album. The Knife on... <laughs> oh, man. I didn't know so many ska artists were a fan of the stream. That's really... That's great. That's just great. Just fantastic. Just... God, it's so special. Uh, I'll keep this. <laughs> I'm glad you like that song that came out 20 years ago. Day two life. Gonna rise up, rise up. Yeah, I figured that was gonna happen. J -j -j Judy. So here I am, playing all the gates I can. I got this ram, and it's gonna. Oh, I think it's gonna slam. Rise up. We can play Priest into Foot Fiend. Probably Priest into Foot Fiend, right? You guys want to see my Foot Fiend? It's Foot Light Fiend. Man, I love hearing Americans do English accents, especially. Uh, that wasn't an English accent. That was just a... That was literally a Curb Your Enthusiasm meme. Sense. Any theories on why people might not like that reincline as much as MTGO? I find myself liking MTGO better, and I can't figure out why. Maybe because the cards in play don't look like. Okay, so actually, some people made some complaints. Some people made some comments on YouTube about it, and some of them were pretty like pretty reasonable comments. Like made sense. I was like, all right, I can get that. Um, let's see if I can find them. Oh, uh, I'm gonna go to the actual comment because it's broken up, and the in the email notification is not broken up. 
uh, interface. So arguments are made on either side of liking or hating. I'm actually going to play first. Oh, they went back up to 23 and played an 8-8. That's fantastic. I am what's known as thrilled. What are they gain? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. 12 life. And they gained 3 from this. So they gained 15 life total. So they would be at 8 if, uh, if that wasn't a thing. Rise up. Oh, yes. Do that. Pop, pop. Um, Hating the re I Personally, I hate that I can't see all the cards, and the physical manipulation seems a bit off to me. Not sure why, but I still can't. I can still watch. No, at this point I put more... Uh, I think I put more succinctly one of your followers was close to. It's that this is what MTGO could have gradually updated to, but again, I think the reasons it didn't are mentioned above. I think the amount of time and energy spent developing Arena, a lot of players see as something that could have been spent on MTGO to make that a better interface. Arena has sound effects, animations. How long do you think it took to program that? And MTGO still has bugs with cards. Like, come on, there's also no doubt that since both MTGO and Arena are owned by the same company, and Arena will continue to get larger and larger, there will be a point when both are, are not sustainable for Wizards. Um, this is a lot of lands. Cool, they gained more life. I think this actually, this matchup is probably impossible for us to ever win. Just based on, like, the card quality they have and the, like, they can play, like, a, a guild, or like, a guild summit here and they draw one, two, three, four, five, six, six cards. Erickson, thank you so much for the sub, really appreciate it. Lamagloyf, thank you for the sub, really appreciate it. You guys are great. Thank you. Okay. Yep, that's where I draw the line. Going to 37 life. This this deck feels really bad against it. I mean, feel, we feel really bad against this deck, I think. But I'm a Superman. Here I am, doing everything I can. What are the Angress? Are they just really good here? Probably. I'll, I don't. I wouldn't say it feels bad unless you get a turn four kill. I think we've actually been doing pretty well. Doing everything I can. I hate Chris and Elk Tears. Uh, Duress is good because it gets rid of both Guild Summit and it gets rid of Gates of Blaze, both of which are very, very good against us. Wow. <laughs> Triple Hero, Double Gutter Bones. I'd keep this if we were playing poker, but... Yeah, this is actually great. Yeah, if you can snag a Gates of Blaze... Oh... I'm gonna bottom you. I think we can hit more lands in, like, three turns. Forgot about the 420 gates of blaze it. Why didn't I? Oh, I can't. There's no way I can. I was like, why didn't I play gutter bones? Oh, because we can't. I'd keep this over playing poker. Nice. Yeah, I mean, like, I feel like I've said that before. This is definitely not the first time I've used that meme, but. Oh, look, a full house. Fantastic. Every time I see the scorpion, I want to click it too. Sometimes I forget. Hey, it's new life. Uh, play this guy. Play old Bony Maroney, I guess. Gates of Blaze, because they always have it. I'm going to preemptively say it. Lucky, 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 lucky. Gain three and then play Gates of Blaze. Oh, just a ram? Oh, wow. So 
So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think it's actually better value to stack this guy. Oh, we actually could have mortified, put the mortify on the stack. Oh, that would have been good. In response to mortify on the stack, sacrifice the new token. So if they end up winning by like one point. What if Marvel's watching your stream and they write your cover letter for you using out of content? What, Marvel's gonna write my cover letter for me? That's weird. Why would they do that? Okay. Old Rammy McGammy. Um, I'm gonna decline. Oh, and grab. Gonna run. I really don't want this guy to just hold us back, right? But they have one card, so I feel like we're okay if we just pass here. If we attack with everything, they block one. They block here for sure. They take one, two, three, four, five, and we draw a card. I kind of like that because I want to be able to hit a land here and a land next turn to get uh, to get this Angrath out. Even if they are a fan of, of the stream, I don't know why they'd write my cover letter for me. That seems like an interesting thing to do. Thank you. Gunners, welcome back, buddy. I really appreciate it. Well, that is not a land. That is a Footlight Fiend. Oh, they sacked the... They killed this guy instead. Okay. So here I am. This is probably going to be the end, right? This is like a deck where I'm not even counting. You block here, you take 3, 4, 6, 7, 8, 9. That's Xaxes. I don't think this deck has anything instant speed except for Explosion Expansion. Shoot you for one. Wow. What are we, gold? Silver tier three? I don't know what that means. But I'm in it, man. I'm so deep in it. Judy, Judy. I'm gonna keep doing it. I'm just gonna find the Larry David clip and play that. This? No. Yes, it is, of course. That's brown. Somebody's dying. Oh. Can't find it. We're playing first, though. Um, yeah, I'll keep this hand. Judy. Forget it. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Forget it. I don't care anymore. Doing everything I can. God, this song's still in my brain. Nifty Chris, why are you like this? Why are you like this, my dude? Okay. A red land would've been great. No land is worse than great. If someone was like, hey, what would, what would you consider great? I would be like, not no land, that's for sure. I didn't do Goldfinger, I did Boss Tone. <laughs> That's true, but you... Oh my god. Chris, I blame you for both. How's that? How's that? Worse than the likes of you. You may regret that choice. Uh, I'll give you the Land of War Elf. Find Finality is a strong card. Oh. Oh. Wow. So 
we could play this, sack this and the hero. We also mortify on the stack, sack one of the tokens. I like that. Doing everything I can when I'm a superman. Oh my god. I don't know why I'm the sun. What am I doing? Activate. Yes. To the player. This player. Submit it. Two other creatures. I'll sack you and you. I will submit. You must sacrifice a creature. Land. No land, huh? Okay. Please do not do that. Please do not do that. This will aid us. <laughs> Chris sent me a text message. Best two dollars I ever spent. A while yeah. I've seen things that would break yeah. someone like you. Three, four, five. Well, I'd really like a Judith here. But oh my god, if we had a Judith, can you imagine? Three. Uh, we can send four and two at this. And then two at the co we could actually kill all of your guys. Three, four, five, six, seven. No, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, four would be eight. God, any red source here? Come on, deck. The stars are lessons written in skin. Lessons written in skin? It's graphic. We have to draw off like four cards. Sure. I'm game. Sounds good. Red source. Wow, not a single friggin' red source. That's totally normal. That's a totally normal way to... Meet my newest friend. Any red land? Nope. No, sir. I don't like it. You got it. Hey! Look at that. Look at us. We can get another red land next turn. It'd be great. We can play Fireblade Artist and the Judith. Well, this card is. Unfun. The wilds are my shield. I feel like this. Don't get me demonetized. Yeah, fantastic. Gain six. Is that a is that a Ben Fold song? Yep. Yep. Gain a casual six life against the aggro deck. Seems good. Gain a casual nine life against the aggro deck. Does. Hmm. I'm not losing everything again. Tell me, uh, Superman. Where are my friggin' lands at? This is not okay, guys. Not okay. I should really just have to feel like we have to kill this, to be honest. I don't like it, but...
Hit him right in the jace. You can't stop nature. Yeah, I know. Which is sad, because I'm an aggressive deck. Oh, uh, Hydroid Crassus. Oh, and a second Wild Growth. So it's just like, they have Wild Growth Walkers out the wazoo, and they have Hydroid Crassuses, and we're just like, I can't beat any of these cards, because you're just gaining a million life. Sure, 25 life. Seems good. I mean, we've missed a significant amount of land drops, let's be clear. Yeah, let's go get the double. Um, so we play Judith, we play Forgotten. I don't see how we win here. Let's go to the next game. Blocking? Playing Judy and block? Like, they just kill it. Like, right? Don't they, don't they just have a million... Probably a million ways to deal with it, I would, I would imagine. I feel like the Angrass are great. Oh, uh, I probably want Bedevil instead of Mortify here. But Devil might be better in the main deck anyway. Like, destroying a Planeswalker. We're getting this one random duress. How are the Buffalo Cauliflower Bites? They were amazing, as always. They also have a really good blue cheese. alright. Pinkerton is the other good Weezer album. hi -oh. That's a good one. That is a good one. It's okay, I got another good one. I got good ones for days. I don't have red mana. What the? Is there like a red mana shortage in this deck? I feel like we're always getting stuck on red mana. No blocks. See, this is a nice combo, because now every time we cast a, a gold card, we can activate this off of the, the Toki McMokies. Did you say Toki McMokies? He totally did. Yeah, I feel like getting in situations like this are, are the biggest hurdle we have, or just like, well, we missed our land drop, we don't have a specific color. And then they get to like eight mana, and you're like, oh, well, we have three, so there's nothing to really do about it. Yep, leave that guy on top, like you do. Wow. Think of all the potential value passed up by keeping that Hydroid Crassus on top of it. Haha! Well. Boop, boop, submit. Well, we can't do anything Shut with this up, mana, unfortunately. No attacks. Yeah, no attacks. 
Rivers Cuomo. Hey, Frank, I'm glad you like our song off Scorcho. Check out our newest album, Teal Album. <laughs> I can't actually mention bands anymore. I just can't. There's no band that I want to mention anymore. That ever. Just no. We can activate Priest and Instant Speed, but we draw a card, so I want to be able to play the cards that I draw and see what we get. All the red fences I shred, cello. Yeah. Can, I, can we just crush them with heroic reinforcements next turn? Is that a thing we can do? Is this enough to win? They get one blocker, they block here, they take four, they block here, they take four, five, six, seven, eight, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen. Yeah, that's, this is just ridiculous. And got them! Let's watch it go down. Woo! Woo! Pretty good. Heroic Reinforcements, guys. That's a real card. That's a real Magic the Gathering card. Man, Rivers Cuomo, John Feldman, and... And Dickie Barrett? Wow. I didn't know my stream was so popular amongst musicians, but... Thank you guys for watching. really appreciate it. really appreciate the support. I will keep this hand. <laughs> oh, crying out loud. Uh, yeah, you got it. Those reinforcements were heroes. Those are the most heroic of reinforcements I've ever seen. You keep that? I would always keep that. You keep that? Oh, you're keeping that one though. Interesting, interesting. Well, one way or another, we're definitely playing two things here. Doing everything I can. Here I am. Uh-oh, Sneezy Mike. They can't attack here, right? Oh, who's gibbity dip 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 dip? I'm gonna decline. <sighs> Judy. One. Unfortunately, these don't trigger with Judith, so it's probably just like these two. Maybe it's everybody, but they're not gonna block here for sure. But then we're like wiping the board. So they block these three for sure. I think it's actually just fine. This is a, this is a real, a real thing. A real to do. Yeah, so are they like like just priced into playing Vivian Reed this turn? Ravenous Tuba Cobra on the Judith would be rough. Shut up and take there. my money. Bono, hey Frank, don't care if you like our music, but we downloaded it. We, we, we downloaded our newest album, Songs of Experience, onto your phone. Get wrecked, nerd. 
Wow. <laughs> Bono, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. I'm glad that you guys are still, uh, you know, doing your thing. Doing your... So I can block two and they take a million. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, this is... Yeah, this is. Heroic Reinforcements is not a real magic card. Turn him sideways. This is not a deck. Man, Bono too? God. Tell the edge I said hi. This deck's pretty good. I'm a big fan of this deck. I am a big <laughs> Bono. Wow, you too. money Johnny Cash hey Frank I may be dead but I'm still cooler than you nerd wow oh my god how did he even donate from beyond the grave oh let me check the mana base out on this thing is there a way to do it that doesn't look like this let's do it this way okay so 4 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 red sources 1 2 3 4 5 6 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 16 black sources. White, we have 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So it's 15, 15, 16. And the color distribution is zero base red cards. Lots of black, a couple white. Should be fine. Like I said, I don't know why the Mortifies are in here instead of just Bedevils. I would actually cut one of these and put another Blood cr uh, another Dragon Skull Summon in here. And then I would actually cut the Mortifies. I would just switch them with the sideboard. I think Bedevils is just better. I think there's more Planeswalkers that you care about than Enchantments that you care about. Is that just... Is that correct? Hitting Enchantments is really important. What isn't hitting Shut Planeswalkers even money. more important? Lars Ulrich, I'm only here to make sure you don't play my music on your stream, nerd. Wow. Well, thankfully the Napster days are over, so I'll play your music wherever I want. You, you monster. You uh, R C A A R I R I A A. The Gruel one and the Untap. What? what like we're, this isn't limited, guys. The Untap one. Oh, Wild Reclamation. Like if they have Wild Reclamation, we're probably already dead. Wait, why did it change? I like that it changed to Dragon Skull Summit. I don't. You know what? I was gonna make it. I was gonna change it, but I'll, I think it's fine. We'll just deal with it. <laughs> oh my God! I'm actually. I'm, I'm actually. A, shockingly amazed at all the musicians who have frequented the stream tonight Dave Hilliard I didn't see enough I didn't see enough love for the scars so I figured I would drop you a sexy dollar <laughs> oh and Weird Al Yankovic I'm strange <laughs> Shut up and take my money. oh god <laughs> oh Jesus for one dollar you too can emulate your favorite musician for only a dollar a stream Wow. Oh, uh, the February Modern announcement is interesting. I'm really curious myself what it might be because... Uh, block? Oh, you got me. Cute little nug there. You did a little nug. I find it really interesting that the joke user donations thing is so popular. I think it's a cool hilarious video. I agree with you. I think it's fantastic. I'm a big fan of it. So here I am. 
You're gonna bedevil this guy and see a counter spell. What do you have? Negate in your main deck. Let's <laughs> get deep and deep Oh, because uh, it's interesting because, yeah, my my big prediction is that they are going to bypass standard, uh, which I think is something they should have done a long time ago. And it's also something I've suggested multiple times. Um, I've made the suggestion that you should literally have sets like Conspiracy, where the cards are legal and modern, and standard is like, it's it's too prohibitive a gateway uh, to get... Wow, they just had another Wild Growth Walker into... Oh, no, they actually... This is the one they negated. Sure. Um... Having to go through standard is too prohibitive a gateway for a format as strong as modern. And I think you can solve a lot of problems by just printing specific cards that don't need to be in standard. Like a, like a Flusterstorm card, you know? Um, where you're able to print answers that aren't great in standard or, or might be too powerful in standard. But are fine in older formats. In older formats. So, that's my... So here I am, doing everything I can. Oh, uh, yep. Psych. Target you. Submit. Well, we can't kill anything, so we're just going to shoot them twice. And then we're going to hope we draw, like, a uh, removal spell. We draw Thank you. That's cool. Cow two heads, we made it this far. Let's keep the trainer roll. Thanks so much, man. I really appreciate the resub. Well, they gained six life, so they'd actually be at five life if they didn't gain a million life. they keep doing. Yep, I would definitely keep that on top because you can just get back Jade Light Ranger and this Jade Light Ranger when they die, and that's another 12 life, which is totally reasonable. But you didn't actually keep that. I guess because you want to hit lands, I understand. I don't think a development of a set like that is any more challenging than developing something like Conspiracy, right? Which is going to go into Legacy and, and Vintage, right? I mean, just because yeah, modern is more played, it doesn't mean you have to take any less care with it. Or with the other formats, rather, is what I mean to say. Baz Lerman, I was serious about the sunscreen. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh man. Alright, so... We could sack both these. I don't think that's great. I also don't think we're in great shape here. Despite having a very slow start, this is a timely negate, unfortunately. I mean, Wild Growth Walker is really just problematic. This is a, a three, this is a one three. So this is triggered five times, which is literally 15 life, which means they would be at three right now. Thank you for being my go-to subscriber, dude. <laughs> So for four, you gain two more life. Or for one. Okay. Sure. Heroic reinforcements, one time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and ninth land. Okay, so let's take out one Footlight Fiend, one Priest, one Theater, bring in three Lava Coils, 
I still think of both the theaters. I think they're good, but I just don't feel like we're ever having it. We're, we're never in a chance where, like, I don't know. We haven't actually drawn this once, I don't think. I think we might have drawn it once and we just didn't have a chance to cast it, but I think we've drawn it once out of all of them. Out of all of them, all of them being the matches. I'll take another priest out for a duress. Two duresses, done. Right, it would just be a set that bypasses standard. It's not a specifically modern set, but like the set also makes cards for legacy, for vintage, for commander, whatever. Mulliganos. I'm gonna go to five here. I'm just gonna hope we hit land off of the first couple cards. Monarch and Modern be gas. I mean, if they want to make it more like Legacy with, uh, without fetch land, without dual lands, fine with me. Without wasteland, sure. Without brainstorm, great. Doing everything I can. Why can't I find a red land? Oh, no blocks, huh? A bold strategy, Cotton. Okay, so we're gonna just lose this game because we have no land. We deal three, they deal six. Who's the aggressive match? Deck, who's the aggressive deck? What's old modern? What even is that? <laughs> Where's your mortify now, stupid? All right, we're just gonna scoop here. Uh, how well would it do? Probably very well. Modern is an extremely popular format. When Modern was Pro Tour, or like when, when there's a Modern Grand Prix, uh, the coverage, their Modern numbers are higher than any other format. Modern is like one of their most popular formats. So uh, that's just something to keep in mind. Just a little food for thought there. Agent Conundrum, no worry. Good games. Good games. Yeah, for some reason we're having a hard time getting red mana. And there's like the, the same number of red mana as there are every other color, so... What can you do? Modern is not an eternal format, just to be clear. This is a distinction I want to make sure everyone knows. It is not an eternal format. Eternal does not mean it doesn't rotate. Eternal means all cards are legal. Eternal and non-rotating are two different things. Oh, we did it. Nailed it.
A non earth thing that's reasonably affordable is good. I agree. It's a good point. It's a solid point. Uh, I'll take out a Foot Light Fiend. But Devils are still good. Take out a Theater. Just bring in two Duress here. Oh, actually, this is where we want the. This is where we want Mortify instead of the Devils. So that was my bad. Oh, Bright Pain. Thank you so much for the uh, the Patreon support. Really appreciate it. If you guys don't know, you can go to my Patreon page. It's a different way to support the content that is produced on Twitch and YouTube. We'll keep this hand. It's really slow and bad, but... It is nice that they reprint Shocklands pretty regularly. That is pretty okay. I'm just going to play Priest here. And I'm going to assume you don't have untapped land into Guild Summit. And then we can get our... Yeah, alright. Then we can get our best for this. Uh, Gates Ablaze. Do we have a way to deal with the worm? We do. Alright, yeah, we'll just take the gates. Then that, is why, we even, that is why we bring that in, my dudes. Elias, just thinking about you. How have you been since our match? On board any parties. Is this really a meme? I don't actually even understand. I still don't get this meme, guys. I still don't really understand what's happening here. Also, having Priest and being able to sacrifice Gutter Bones or one of the tokens here is pretty good. Yeah, this is all fine. I feel like we're pretty far ahead here. Shocks are nice. Fetches are better. Dual lands are even better. Let's get some dual lands. Alright, as long as they don't have Gates Ablaze here randomly in one of these three cards, there are three in your deck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That, be, that is probably going to be lethal. I can guarantee you that's lethal. <laughs> Got him. Man, heroic reinforcements. What a card. What a card, ladies and gentlemen. Rank up. Silver tier 2. Alright, let's get one more in. Mulligan. Eh, this is fine. Two drop, three drop, four drop, whatever. We don't have the double black, but... We also don't have any untapped lands. <laughs> Uh, okay. Um, let's give it a go. Sure. Are you proud of yourself? No. No, not at all. Oh, a literal god. Wow, we're playing against a literal god. That's awkward. I had no idea, you see. They missed the land drop? This guy gonna get shocked? Yeah. yeah. That's the noise I made. Run away, steam can never come back. Run away on a steam can track. I'm actually just gonna play this. Thank you. Jiggity Jaws, thanks so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Man, I thought we were at 547 a second ago. We must have lost like four subs between now and then. It's so sad when it goes down. Don't go down. No lands. A land. 
and a skewer. Okay. Nice up. Wow. Be aggressive. Be e aggressive. Gutter snipe too. This is aggressive. Okay, two lands, two lands. I'll trade for that snipe. Didn't think so, my dude. I think we're dead. Take two. Are they tapped out? They are tapped out. Doesn't have trample. Eh, I'll just block. Yeah, I think when they have gutter snipe on board, blocking is probably pretty decent. So, this guy has enters tapped, that's rough. Okay, that's your play for the turn though, which is pretty okay. Oh, that's not, you guys, I forgot you got that runway steam connection. That's sad. Oh, Adelias Official! I heard y'all dorks were talking about me. Wow, that's... So how much damage is... If we just draw, like, one more level... Sure. So we have seven. We take three from this guy. If they attack. I have to assume they'll attack. Two, two, it's a three, three, two, two, and a two, two. That would be game. Okay. So I don't think they have planeswalkers, so we can actually just bring in Mortify because it's easier on the mana. Double, 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 double. Yeah, Theater's a little too slow in this matchup for sure. Elias approves. Wow. Elias, I don't even know who you are, my dude. I'm so sorry. So what do we got? We got seven slots, so we're gonna go lava, 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 duress, duress, duress. I think that should be good. Run away, steam can never come back. If you play the deck, I'm interested in buying. How are you finding the deck? I think the deck has been fine so far. I have had no cons no complaints with it. Uh, it does have a little bit of a problem against things like wild growth walkers and like hydroid crassuses for a lot of mana. But, I mean, we've actually beaten Sultai a good amount of times, so I'm not, like, super... I don't think it's that big of an issue. Uh, let's get rid of your light up the stage, because that's just basically more cards for you. What do you got? A little plains? A little mountain? Okay. So you have shock for Lilith, which is sad. But what are you gonna do? What am I gonna do? Not not play not or, or, I said Lilith, Judith. You know, the other uh T 
take action. If you decline, you're you know, I feel like that was interesting. I guess they take one more if they don't shock there, whereas they waste two mana. Weighing those odds, I would definitely err on the side of risk factoring, so. It's a lot of mana. Fewer lands would be nice. But here we are. I mean, if they're just going to keep doing... If they're, they're going to risk factor, that's fine. I'll just take it. Yep, get a six. You have one shock in hand. Shock to the face? Wow. That is aggressive. Because you basically have to draw two cards in order to... Like, there's no four damage spell, right? Sure. I will decline. I have one mana, so... Okay. Two mana. Shot. Seems good. One, two, three, four, five, six. And we can sacrifice... Yeah, well, this should be game. No, it's not, because we can't actually sack and deal the damage. Dang it. Right? One, two, three, four, five, six. But then we have no way to sack the creatures as well. Oh, they take two extra from here. Yeah, this, this is... I believe. Where's the life gain in this deck? I'm just gonna add the other duress. Because I think heroic reinforcements are great. I'm not sure. <sighs> oh my god. Elk Tear is this meme, dude. Tap, so we'll just play this for now. Chain Whirler is something here. They don't have a third land, though. Okay, well, that's nice to see. No third land, my dude. Are we just going to win? cast any of these if they have a shock I'd be surprised because they let us res they let us keep both of these okay well we're doing well for for ourselves what does this say what does spectral say you can cast a spell if, if an opponent lost life this turn 
it is a sorcery though, so that's not really relevant. I don't think any of their sor any of their spectacle herds are gonna be relevant here. So we're just gonna double heroic reinforcements and then assume the game is over. Because magic is pretty easy. <sighs> GG's. I guess we're not I guess we haven't won yet. They could play Chain Whirler here. Yeah, and we draw infinite and I think Fireblade Arse would have also done it. Like, as long as we get through a point, I think we're fine. I'm watching the smartphone, how can I see the list? Uh, lots of ways. Lots of ways. And it should be also on the, the extension, the overlay. I'm not sure if that still works for mobile. But, as far as matches go, I think we're good. I think we're going to end it there. Uh, that was like five or six matches. That's a good amount. So thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Send us a like and subscribe and check me out on Twitch and Patreon. Links are in the description below. And you can uh, also check out meundies.com slash franklapore. You'll get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. Uh, those links are also in the description below. So click on that affiliate link. It helps me out. It's a great way to support the stream. If you are buying underwear or you need a onesie or if you need cotton socks or, you know, something just super, super comfortable clothing, definitely check those links out. And, uh... Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you next time. Really appreciate it.